Well, that is the biggest myth right there that you've caused your dog separation anxiety. And if if anybody listening to this takes that away today, that they should absolve their guilt, that they have somehow created this perfect storm to create this behavior problem. Um, I know that um, there are many, many bits of advice out there like you know, only pet your dog or give your dog attention if they um, are you know, exhibiting appropriate behaviors or uh, don't let your dog sleep in the bed and, uh, you know, don't, don't let your dog up on the couch and don't give your dog too many treats or bring them on outings with you as often and, and those sorts of things. Boy, the number of clients that I've worked with that are bursting into tears on the very first phone call saying, my neighbor told me that I've caused it, or my mother-in-law told me that I've caused it, or a host of people, right? And, and I don't think that that is true nor helpful. So please absolve your guilt about the the fact that you have created this actual problem.